Waste is an unavoidable consequence of everyday life. In terms of volume, radioactive waste is a very small portion of all waste. It's the byproduct of millions of medical procedures each year, industrial and agricultural applications that use radiation, and nuclear reactors that generate around 10% of global electricity. Radioactive waste requires careful management to protect people and the environment from radiation now and in the future. Radioactive waste is first characterized to determine its physical and chemical properties, as well as its radioactivity. It's then processed, which may include sorting, decontamination, and steps to reduce volume. The waste is classified based on its long-term management objectives and put into a safe condition for interim storage and, ultimately, disposal. Very low-level waste and low-level waste contain small amounts of radioactive substances. It includes waste generated by industries and hospitals or items such as clothes used in nuclear facilities. This waste requires minimal isolation and is suitable for disposal in near-surface facilities. Intermediate-level waste is more radioactive and typically comprises materials from decommissioned reactors and research laboratories. It requires more containment and isolation. High-level waste presents the greatest hazard. It accounts for a minute portion of the total volume of all radioactive waste and includes waste from nuclear power plants. High-level waste requires greater containment and its disposal is planned in engineered facilities several hundred meters underground. In the meantime, it is safely stored in purpose-built facilities. The IAEA provides support to countries in the safe management of all radioactive waste.